Titillating Tuesday. Does it make you laugh? Does it make you laugh? There's nothing to laugh about right now, you know. Uh, but obviously, um, there's, there hasn't been anything to laugh at for us TIs for quite a while. <laughs> so this is just another day in the park, you know. So um, the jokes I wanted to do today about pubs is when we pub ourselves, as human beings, we do things that collectively emerge phenomena that pop us. You know, you know what I mean? Yeah. So um, I, in my video yesterday, I talked about how when people form what you call an imagined crowd, where um, just by walking through the same stretch of road, they create a, a crowd that emerges over time. Yeah. Um, it's. Uh, a bit like weighing light you can't weigh it but if you <laughs> was to take a light beam that's um, a bit uh, like one light year across and put it on a scale I'm sure you will have weight <laughs> anyway um, so people um, have different desires at different stages in their lives so um, you have like a mixing of it's random yeah but um, there are patterns that can uh, emerge from random behavior on a global scale. Um, like uh, I keep using that example. If you was to ask people to walk through a set of double doors, one door of a set of two, uh, and place their hands directly in front of them, you see a, <laughs> a diffraction. So people have um, ways of parping themselves from just not knowing enough. And since we don't know everything in the world, what we need to know, we're going to pop ourselves. <laughs> just just by being normal you know what i mean yeah so um people don't like there's people who don't know enough to be spooked about the things we're spooked about those are dangerous to you that's like an idiot with a gun so <laughs> try to avoid them ones try to it's about avoiding dumbass situations just just to keep yourself going yeah avoid situations where you have to know you have to know it's, I, I call it that time, I call it malignorance, yeah? When you don't know if it's malice or mali or ignorance, that's malignorance. <laughs> and people have a lot of that. So someone can be popping you, but they might not know anything about it. It might be an accepted idea. He might be, he might have acquired uh, an OCD that is being used by his handler, yeah? <laughs> to perpetrate on you, yeah? So you never know, yeah? So you just have to... When you see someone who's picked up a habit uh, and it's too long, it's too long to talk to them about it, <laughs> yeah, just avoid that one. Like I picked up a habit where I'm always scratching my eye. Was it my nose? No, my eye I was scratching. But I've lost that habit now. <laughs> so, <laughs> and you examine, uh, reflect, and um, assess, reassess yourself to see if you picked up any habits. Uh, take a stretch of time in your life, like um, a 20 minute stretch and... Uh, just watch yourself for 20 minutes yeah whenever you do something remember to write it down <laughs> like just be spontaneous and remember to write it down you see you see a lot of things that have been accepted in you from um, through um, your day-to-day -day life and you haven't noticed yeah people just um, behaving funny can start you behaving funny monkey see monkey do mirroring yeah so <laughs> we accidentally do most of these things I'm not saying that's the cause of everything that we've noticed, but some of it is accidental, just through malignorance. Yeah, malignorance is a superposition of two words, malice and ignorance. So <laughs> whenever they're in superposition, whatever you suspect, it will be the other. All right. So this is the way it turns out for us. When you're being um, victimized uh, through demonic par uh, perpetrating, whatever you think it's going to be, it will be the other. Yeah. So you can't trick nature. So it's as if, anyway, <laughs> because it's like the double slit experiment. Whenever you realize that you've seen, it will stop happening. Yeah, so it's a bit like that. Yeah, um, it's very, very deep cursing for targeted individuals who have demonic, uh, a demonic component to their perpetrate, to, to their parping. Yeah, so I just wanted to touch on that and uh, also see a funny side of it. It's like, don't take everything to heart and don't react violently all the time. Yeah, remember, some of them are just malignant. <laughs>
Does it make you laugh? Does it make you laugh? Ciao.